we argue that uh, the formation of the United States was not a great leap forward for humanity. Uh, how can you say that when the indigenous lost their land and lost their sovereignty? Uh, how can you say that when there were thousands of Africans in the late 18th century under the stars and stripes and millions by 1861 on the verge of the US Civil War? And so uh, that particular notion is encapsulated in the book you so kindly mentioned, speaking of I Dare Say, in one of the pieces I characterize that as a kind of left-wing white nationalism. It's a reflection of the monetized and militarized identity politics that helped to establish the United States in the first place, speaking of the construction of whiteness, the construction of white supremacy, uh, 